The overall goal of this procedure is to fabricate a reconfigurable microfluidic device with sidewalls made of an array of pins. The main advantage of this microfluidic device is its ability to deal with difficult to flow object and situations that may be unknown at the channel design stage. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle to etch tiny pins into lock bone shapes. Visual demonstration of this method is critical as the assembly of many microfluidic parts and mounting them on a base are difficult to learn from only in a written protocol. This photo is of the completed microfluidic device with a reconfigurable channel. Here the reconfigurable portion is along the top of the image. An exploded view schematic reveals some of its principal components. In particular, note the microchannel and the pins used for reconfiguring it. As a first step, etch the pins. Begin with degreased 0.3 mm thick L-shaped stainless steel pins of different lengths. Have ready 4 ml of 10% nitric acid and immerse the pins in it. Then place the container in a 65 degrees Celsius oven for 30 minutes. After retrieving the pins, transfer them with tweezers one by one to a container of deionized water. Next, sonicate them in the water for 5 minutes. When done, dry them with a paper towel. Have ready 0.5 milliliters of mold release agent and immerse the pins in it. After two hours, place the pins in deionized.